Jackson Pollock, The Catalyst Paul Jackson Pollock was an American painter and a major figure in the Abstract Expressionist movement. He uses drip technique to paint his paintings which caused a major debacle among his critics. Paul Jackson Pollock was born in the year 1912 on the January of 28 in Cody, Wyoming, United States. He died on the August of 11, 1956 at only at the age of 44. Number 17A was Jackson Pollock's earliest painting which launched his career to stardom. It was painted in the year 1948, a year after Jackson Pollock introduced his drip technique. The piece was even featured in the August 1949 edition of Life that made Jackson Pollock a celebrity. Another painting by Jackson Pollock is the mural on Indian Red Crown. It is created in the year 1950s and it was thought to be Jackson Pollock's greatest creation ever. This art right now is valued about $250 million dollars and it is now located in Tehran Museum of Contemporary Art in Tehran. Number 31 is one of the largest and most prominent paintings of Jackson Pollock. It was created in the year 1950 and it was owned by a private collector until the year 1968. It was later then moved and purchased by the Museum of Modern Art in New York City and has been displayed there ever since. This work can be called one of the most acclaimed paintings of Jackson Pollock, of course, if it really was painted by his hand. This painting was the subject of a long-lasting war between the artist's mistress Ruth Klingman and his widow Lee Krasner. Klingman claimed that the painting was the last work that the artist painted before his death. Moreover, she claimed that she saw him painting it and when the painting was completed, Pollock gave it to his beloved with the words, Here's your painting, your own Pollock. Krasner insisted that the artist stopped painting long before death, and this painting was nothing more than a fake and not a very skillful one. Lee Krasner was Jackson Pollock's wife. They were married in the year 1945. It is said that Krasner influenced her husband's work very much. This is because Krasner had intensive knowledge and training in modern art and techniques that helped her bring Pollock up to date with what contemporary art should be. Krasner is also often considered to have tutored her husband in the tenets of modernistic painting. Pollock was then able to change his style to fit a more organized and cosmopolitan genre of modern art. Jackson Pollock was one of the main contributors towards the abstract expressionism art movement. He encapsulated the inventive spirit of various artists around the world. He became the equation which led to innovation of art in which we still use and innovate today. He changed the way people look at art to find meaning in scribbles and splatter of paint, to find calmness and meaning in a mass of lines and color. His work will forever be immortalized in the history of art. Thank you.